Hey guys, welcome back to another video by Simply Learn. In today's video, we're going to be learning all about enumeration in C. But before we begin, if you haven't subscribed to our channel already, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to never miss an update. So now, without any further delay, let's begin. This session will help you to understand what enumeration in C is. And next, what is enum used for? Then, let's understand the enum declaration in C. And finally, let's execute a simple program using enum. So now, let's get started with what enumeration in C is. Enum is a user-defined data type consisting of an integral constant. In short, enum is a keyword that allows a user-defined data type consisting set of integral constants. The syntax is enum, enum name, and list of constants separated with the help of comma operator. Now let's see what is enum used for. So basically, enum is used to allocate a name to the integral constant. In the given below example, we have enum as a keyword, fruit as a user-defined data type, followed by enumerated constants, mango, apple, grapes, and banana inside the curly brackets. Since this list of enumeration constants comes under the category of fruits, we have fruits as a user-defined data type, which is possible with the help of the keyword enum. All right. In C programming, the compiler assigns integer values to all the enumeration constants by default. And that begins from 0, 1, 2. Okay. So let us move on to the enum variable declaration. Here, let us consider another example where we have month as a user defined data type and January, February, March, April, May, and June as constant. As discussed before, by default, the compiler will assign values to the constant. It is even possible for the user to assign new integer values to the list of constants. For example, the value 5 is given to the constant March and the value 9 is assigned to the constant June. Then, the compiler will automatically assign values to the rest of the constants that are starting from Jan is equal to 0, then Feb is equal to 1, April to 6 because it considers the previous constant value plus 1, so that is 6, then May as 7, again last value that is 6 plus 1 is equal to 7. And then comes the variable declaration. So as given below, the variable m is declared of the type month. And this variable can have only one value from the listed enumeration constant. That is, multiple values for a single variable are not allowed. But we can also declare various variable declaration for listed constants. For example, m1, m2, m3 and so on. Next, we can assign enumeration constant to the variables like m1 is equal to March, and m2 is equal to April and etc. So now, m1 and m2 will hold an integer value 5 and 6 respectively. I hope you got a clear understanding of the use of enum in C programming. All right. Now let's execute a simple program using enum. Choose from over 300 in-demand skills and get access to 1,000 plus hours of video content for free. Visit SkillUp by Simply Learn. Click on the link in the description to know more. So in this particular example, we are trying to print the integer value of variable m and m1. We have already assigned value 9 to the constant April. So now let's see the output. As you can see the output, the value of m is 2. So it's a default value assigned by the compiler. And the value of m1 is 9, assigned by the user. So with this, we have come to the end of this session on the enumeration in C programming. I hope this session was informative and interesting. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.